All right, you guys. Welcome back. This is Ben Powell again, coming at you from uh, GuitarJams.com, and we're going to continue with our finger picking blues exercise that we were doing. Uh, we're in the standard tuning, and we're using our fingers today. So put down the flat pick. You don't need finger picks. The flesh of your finger works just fine. Um, so either way you want to do that's great. Basically, we covered a little bit. Uh, we'll take it a little bit further for you in the same tune. So here's what we did in the last lesson. A little recap for you. So we're going to take that one step further by introducing the, the next note here. Is the, and basically what we're doing there is add it. It's the, from the G, G7, G, and then an open D string and an open E string at the same time. That's the note you we're going to hear, want to end on for that, that particular stopping point. Okay, and then once you feel comfortable with that, I'll add the next note for you. That kind of gives us a little blue sound there. What, uh, what note is that? And that's going to be our pinky finger on the G string, third fret. So to get the correct sound in this little tricky part, and it is tricky, uh, two fingers consecutively stroking the G string and then the B string. And your pinky's third while, fret on the G string. While fingering this shape right here. So now I'm going to break this into a couple pieces for you. I would say that's a nice first phrase. It's in the G to a G7 back to the G with the alternate thumb. So it's going from a G to the G7 to the G and then open pinch, pinky on the G string, third fret, open B string. And then so for the third part, open. So we don't move the fingers, all the action's happening right here, and basically it's the G, G7, G, open pinch, G string, open B string, open D string, and then our G string. Alright Ben, I've never done this before man, I know I've played guitar for a while, but uh, but I wanted to see if I, if I got it right, you can tell me if I did it right. So I got a G chord here. And we're doing the ring finger, middle finger, pinky, right? Perfect, perfect. Then with my thumb and middle finger, and I don't use finger picks, the first thing I'm going to do is perfect. that, correct? That's right, perfect. Okay. So then I'm going to add my thumb to the open D string next, right? So we go, correct? That's it. Okay, so we got that. Then the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to move my pinky to the first fret of the, of the high E string and play that. Right? Yep. Nice G7. Those two. G7, right? So we're going to go... Correct? That's it. Okay. Then the original one again, right? Yep. Nice G. Good. So then we have... We have that. The next thing that we're going to do, and you can correct me here, is the open D and the open high E. That's right. Correct? So, when we put those together... Perfect. Then the next thing I need to do is get my pinky 
my left pinky on the third fret of the G string, right? That's right. And we're going to go like this. Thumb? Do I thumb it or do you... You know you're going to use your... Uh, index finger? Index finger and your ring. That's exactly right. So, so the next thing we need to do is index to open B string. Right? That's right. Okay, so let's try that. That's why we're not using our thumb for that, is because our thumb is busy doing the alternate pattern Back and with forth, the Ds. Right? That's right. So we got perfect, perfect. It's a nice little triplet there. Right back to the vibe again. That's right. So that's the whole thing. That's it. So let's try it again. Basically it, Marty. And you'll notice that nice little syncopation that just makes you want to makes it jump. That's it, man. I have to immediately go into that. Cool. I learned something, folks. What what, what can you say? <laughs> nice work, Ben. Alright. You see what I mean? Like yeah. That makes sense. I wasn't right? showing your face when you said I. No, no, no. You're good. You're good. It's fine. It's rad, dude. Okay. Can't believe you got that like that. It's almost like <coughs> it worked.